I used to tell people that I had a little sister, but it was my cat. <laughs> Welcome to the Girl Got Faith channel. I am Emma. I'm Kyra. And today we are doing a little get ready with us. We're just gonna have a little chit chat and do our makeup. Get ready. It's the weekend. It so is. we're trying to look cute. Yep, <laughs> we are. Right, I feel like Kyra is a lot better at doing makeup than me. So you have like a lot more kit. I've got oh hair gosh. products okay, in as well, what? just in case my hair gets have messy. You? I didn't think about my hair. This is my, whoop, it's gonna fall out. Here we go. Put in a little glass, <laughs> not glass, plastic. This is my big chunk of chunk Oh, okay. Are we going through like what products or is it? Oh, whoops, I just went in. Yeah, Sorry, no. guys. Okay, that was a tinted moisturizer. <laughs> tinted moisturizer what do you from start with? I start with my primer. Oh, okay. Which doesn't have a lid, so yeah, it's, it's probably really, really manky. Oh, really? Well, it's just tinted moisturizer, but. Yeah. See, I use this as a primer. But that's not really. I don't so, think so. No. Okay. Where's yours from? <laughs> NYX. Okay. NYX. Oh, is that what that's called? And okay. NYX. Oh, yeah, I just never knew is what it, it actually is. I don't know. Yeah, well. mine's Bare Minerals. Well, it's <laughs> what the uh, the blue beauty vloggers do. Okay, no, you still can't see it, can you? Okay, YouTuber. Okay, no, you can't see it. Um, yeah, I was literally on TikTok mm -hmm. um last night, and I was just I don't ever actually post any videos. But I was on just TikTok. like having a little look, you know when you just laugh at other people's videos? Yeah. And then it was on like the camera thing and I was like, I wonder what new filters and settings that they've got. Yeah. You can do a whole face of makeup on the settings on TikTok. It's so I was crazy. there with like absolutely no makeup on. I was babysitting for my sister and not for my sister, for my sister's kids. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and um, yeah, I was like, I had no makeup on and I did lips, eyelashes, eyeshadow, really? contour. Yeah, everything. What? Like literally, let me show you. That's crazy. I know. Okay, look guys. Oh, oh wait, let it focus. So yeah, go on. Look. That is like <laughs> not me right no, now. That's crazy. How wild is that? Well that's a bit scary. Like yeah. how do you feel about that? Do you think it's okay? Because I guess like at the same time we've been working from home, like yeah. I feel like in this period, I haven't really put on any makeup. But yeah, no, I do feel like the TikTok thing is actually very wild because That's mad. I don't know about you, but like I remember, I don't know, the, people probably still say it, but like when you're younger and you start kind of getting into makeup and whatever, yeah. and people are like, oh no, you have to just love your real face and like don't use makeup to cover up, da da da, and then you can't go back to, well, you can, but it's hard to go back to not wearing makeup and yeah. feel like less than or whatever mm -hmm. but then now with the filters and stuff i feel like people aren't even comfortable being on camera with makeup yeah, on it's with true. their real face it unless there's true. a filter on i'm not gonna lie if i'm gonna post something on insta story i'll slap on a filter if i have makeup or no makeup why mm. like i think i don't know in my head it's like if i can have smooth skin then why yeah. wouldn't I? Yeah. But it's also bad at the same time. But I also don't really think that God is like against makeup. Yeah. I don't feel like it's a bad thing. And I think it can be like fun as yeah. well. Especially if you enjoy it. And be it. creative. Yeah. yeah. Like explore different looks. You actually have to kind of protect your mental health a little bit. Because if you know that you're someone who is going to feel really like insecure or down about yourself yeah. or whatever. You've always got to look at the root cause. And I think it's important to, um, I don't know, like work out why is it that you're feeling insecure or are things going to feed your insecurity even more Yeah. and like guard yourself against it yeah. almost. Um, but then if you know that you can just like have fun with filters and makeup and whatever, go for it. Yeah. But it's always about like checking in and making sure yeah. the reasons why you're doing, like putting your makeup on. I'm just putting on some cream blusher in case anyone wanted to know. <laughs> um, just dab it on. This is the, it's actually the, um, what's her name? Oh, Selena Gomez, her, <laughs> her brand. Oh, okay, you can't what's see that one name? either. It's called Rare Beauty. Ooh. It's very good. Do you feel like your makeup style has evolved over the years? I feel like when I was at school, when I was at school, I wouldn't wear makeup at all. Really? Were you allowed? Yeah, we were allowed, but 
my mum didn't really wear makeup. Oh, so okay. I didn't really, I mean, I didn't have products in the house that I could just try. Like I remember it's so weird. <laughs> and my dad always tells me, I was in, I think I was in year 11. And I was like to my dad, I really want to wear a blusher. And I was like, but I just don't know. Like, why am I telling my dad this? <laughs> I was like, I want to wear a blusher. And he was like, okay, let's go shopping. So we went shopping. <laughs> we went shopping. And he was like, well, we were in boots. And I was like, I don't know where to look. And he was like, well, well just have a little look. And then, Did your dad know where to look? He didn't know where to look. <laughs> He's like, yeah, just go have he a kind of just like waited know. at the entrance and like Aww. let me do my own thing. But it was it was a proper thing for me. Like I just didn't know where to start and I would like tell my dad about it and just be like, oh like I don't feel like I don't know. Um I just wasn't very not that I wasn't comfortable, but I wanted to play around with makeup and I just didn't know where to go. Yeah. So you had to kind of learn it all by yourself. Almost. Yeah. And like, I think maybe that's why I love YouTube so much because that's where I've learned a lot. You actually learn so much on YouTube. Yeah. It's very underrated. I don't know if you're going to learn much on this video <laughs> about doing your makeup because we're not really giving you any tips. No, we're just but... like slapping it on. I know. I'm actually doing mine all in the wrong order as well. I've just really? put my concealer on <laughs> after because I forgot to put it oh on. <laughs> Oh I'm blending days. it all together, hoping it works out. I remember in school, I always used to um, think about like, when I was on summer holidays or whatever, yeah. I'd have time to reflect and I'd be like, hmm, what kind of person do I want to go back to school yeah. and be this year? And I would always use like September as my time to like reinvent myself. Mm -hmm. September is always the time. Yeah. That's when you go back to school. Yeah, you've had a good break from like seeing people. Mm -hmm. So then you're like, right, mm, who's I'm Emma going to be? I'm a new girl. Yeah, he's the girl walking into school yeah. this term. <laughs> <laughs> but it's so funny because I think sometimes in this world we feel like we're not allowed to evolve. Or but you like, can. Yeah, but like people think, oh, if you've got a, a specific opinion about something, you're never allowed to change your mind. Or like if you've got yeah. a look that has to be your look and you can't ever change your look. Or if you've got... I don't know, just like certain things that you would embrace as your personality that you can't have the freedom and space to change. Yeah. But I think you so can. And I know like even with some of my friends in school or like in church, they would have like amazing moments when we would go to like the youth camp or whatever yeah. with our church. And then they would really want to be this like different person when we go back, yeah. but then find it hard to actually like be that person yeah and just feel like oh i have to stay in my box as like who everyone thinks that i am or but whatever. you can change well like if definitely. you want to change you can definitely change i i feel like i didn't enjoy school because i didn't really? find my people oh yeah i mean i was with the grunge crew but yeah i was listening and to r and b <laughs> like, like, no. but it was good at the same time because i definitely learned about things that i wouldn't have probably learned about yeah. But at the same time, I should have had that confidence to go and meet people mm. or to go chill with different circles. But I was very much like, I had to stay with my best friend, me and my best yeah. friend. Like, it's us against the world almost. Yeah, that's so true. But it is good that you kind of are around people as well that aren't like you. Yeah. Because I think that always helps to, yeah, like broaden your thoughts and the things that you're interested in and even conversations as well yeah i feel like it's helped me become who i am yeah so i mean it's good in a way but at the same time if you want to float your boat and find new things and try out new things go for it exactly your makeup looks really good really wow Yours is, yours is looking like it's popping. I'm nearly done. Are you? Done. Well, I'm just doing my mascara. No, no rush. No, we're rushing. What mascara just, is this? Oh. It looks like it's really, really doing the works. No, do you know what? I actually got it in a magazine. <laughs> <laughs> it's, um... Those freebies, though. It's sometimes. Benefit. Benefit Roll Lash. Oh. Roller Lash. I can see it's, it's rolling It is lash. rolling it's my really lashes. It's really rolling the lash. But do you know what? I think my lash... This thing, what's it called again? Curler. Curler. Oh, works That's wonders. Really? If I'm not wearing mascara, I'll always just still curl my lashes. Oh. Because I feel like it really like opens your eyes. Okay. 
I don't know. Who wants to try me? that? I think that was the one tool my mum had oh, <laughs> when really? I was yeah. younger. And I was like, yeah. Clamp, clamp. I remember like in school, a lot of my friends would wear a lot of makeup. Yeah. Um, well, actually, not that many of my like specific friends, would but a lot of like people cool would girls? wear makeup. Oh, are you saying I wasn't one of the cool girls? I knew you were going to say that. Out of order. Were you the cool, were you? No, I wasn't. Yeah, I didn't think you were. No, I'm joking. You know what? I used to get so annoyed in school because... <laughs> Because I was actually quite open about my faith in school. Yeah. There was this picture of all the Mr. Men. You know, like, oh, yeah. Mr. Grumpy, yeah, yeah. Mr. Oh, yeah, we had that and someone yeah, the time. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so amazing. There's like a picture of all the Mr. Men. It's like, Mr. What are the, all of them? Mr. Clumsy, Mr. Whatever. Yeah. Or Little Miss Cheesy. Sunshine. Yeah, Little Miss Sunshine, whatever. But then basically people would tag who they like thought was the person that suited that Mr. or Mrs. Man yeah. or woman. What was yours? Um, so every single time, I got tagged in it probably like 11 mm -hmm. times by loads of different people and it was always Little Miss Church Girl. <gasps> What? So I was always Little Miss Church Girl. That's not nice. And obviously, like, I was happy that people knew Recognized that, that I was a Christian. But there's I, nothing wrong with that. Yeah, but I just feel like you it very much became like who I had to always be. Yeah. I was like, oh, Emma's the girl that goes to church. Um, Did you go to like a faith? Um, no. Oh, okay. I just went to a, like a normal what's state school. What's it called? School. A non faith, non denominate? No. Yeah, it's just a non faith school. Yeah. So like anyone of any faith. Um, but yeah, but I think there were actually a lot of Christians in my school. But they just didn't. But people didn't really talk about it because since I've got older, I've and I don't know if maybe because people became Christians later in their lives, but as I've got older, I've seen people who now I didn't know in school were Christian. Really? And I'm like, oh, you were really in church. Okay. And like, you just weren't talking about it. Wow. Because I think people do find it like, I don't know, they just don't really it's talk about it. Yeah. Well. But I'm glad that I was open with my faith. And it did mean a lot of like my friends and stuff would come to church with me. Really? That's so yeah. nice. Yeah, it was quite fun. No, that is nice. I wish I had um, Christian friends at school. Really? I just don't feel like it was mentioned. Like, Yeah, people don't talk, because you were Christian, but like, you yeah, didn't talk no about it. Yeah, no one spoke about it. No so why, about why it. do people not speak about it? I don't know. Because I, like for me, it was kind of, it felt unavoidable. Because people would say, oh, what did you do this weekend? And every weekend I went to church. Yeah. So I'm like, I went to church. <laughs> but to be fair, like, I did go to church as well. Every, like. Yeah. Maybe you just said the other things that you did. Or maybe people just didn't care. Yeah, I think I would say, yeah. like, I would definitely tell my best friend, but I don't, I don't think she cared. It was like, okay, yeah. cool. Yeah. Nice. Or it's like, oh, that's the thing you do. Yeah. Yeah, I get that. But yeah, then I used to always go um, every year to this youth camp. And it was so good. I used to go to one called New Day. Okay. Um, and honestly, it used to be like the highlight of my summer really? every year. But then I think I would always talk to all of my friends about it and be like, oh my gosh, I went to this really cool camp. Like, it was so good. And what, then, what were their reactions And then be? everyone would be like, oh, that's so sick. I want to go camping. Really? Yeah, like people would actually be interested in it. So I feel like, I don't know, maybe my friends and that were just quite open. But I feel like, like, honestly, it's so important to talk about your faith. Yeah, no, it is. Definitely. I think especially because it's a part of you. Like, I think it's important to talk yeah. about anything that makes you, you. Mm -hmm. Because so often what we do is we just talk about the things that we think other people are interested in or that we think yeah. other people can relate to or want to know. Wow, this looks really good. <laughs> Really? Oh, wow, is that a lip liner? Well, it's my eyebrow pencil, but baby, okay. multi purpose. Yeah. Multi, that's multi like, what is that brand? Um, it's just going on very smooth. Yeah, nice. Eyebrow pencil, okay. but. Hey. Very oh, nice. Yeah. Um, yeah, so I was saying that, yeah, I think we often just try and like fit in with everyone else or just don't want to do anything that makes us stand out too much. Yeah. But then, actually, we're multifaceted, you know? 100%. Just talk about what you like and what you're doing at the weekend. 100%. Be honest. You never know who needs to hear it. It's true. It's just like when my little brother was born, I used to go around school telling everybody. Nobody cared. Yeah, exactly. Nobody cared. But it was so important to me. I was like, I've got a little brother, guys. I used to tell people that I had a little sister, but it was my cat. <laughs> Emma, that's a bit worrying. A cat? Why would you say it was a sister? Was it even a, a girl cat? In my room, 
friend Keisha was watching this video, she's gonna laugh. <laughs> because for years I told her about adding little sister because Taylor 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 no, so I always really wanted to have a little sister or a little brother, but I'm the youngest in my family. <laughs> that sounds so weird. Though. What? So yeah, so I never had a little sister or a brother. Um, what? So then I would say that my cat was my little sister. <laughs> I don't even like cats. <laughs> what? Did you actually have a cat? No, I did have the cat, yeah. But it, it obviously wasn't my sibling. How old were you? I was quite young when I would say that the like cat was primary my sibling. school. Yeah, probably like year six. It's <laughs> probably old enough that yeah, it was that like eleven. 12. I remember when I was at primary school, one girl said that her sister was Beyonce. Fully what? believed it. I fully believed it. So that's reminding me about your cat story. What lie do you think that you could like tell people about your life that they would actually believe? I used to tell people that. Um, Venus and Serena were my <laughs> sisters. Because <laughs> they have the same Venus? surname. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. So I'll be like, yeah. They're oh my, my god. They're my sisters. But I wouldn't it wouldn't be to the extent of cat. Like But would they like not question, oh, why do they live in America or why you No, live? like I wouldn't it wouldn't be like a full on it would just be like a joke and then when they would start to believe me I'd be like, haha. Ha, oh, okay. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah. Not not like Okay, so you weren't <laughs> actually trying to deceive people. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh, wait, how have you finished before me? Yeah, I know. That I just quit. I realised I forgot to do my eyeliner. I don't understand the order that I've done things in yeah. in this video. I do have liquid eyeliner, but I'm not about to attempt it. You're doing that really well. I'm just, uh, well, do you know what? Eyeliner has been the thing that I've done ever since I was younger. Really? I don't know how you're doing it whilst talking. Yeah. I have to like stop. I know it's gonna make me go me. wrong. Oh, oh dear. Pressure, pressure, pressure. Okay, here we go. Where's go this go. one from? This is Glossier. Mm -hmm. Glossier? Glossier? Glossier. Glossier. Um, it's called. What is it called? Pro Tip. Mm. So yeah, oh yeah, it's not, it's not the best, not gonna lie, not my best work. It's alright. But it'll do. I'm just gonna put. Good. I just put a little clear, uh, a clear one on the top. Clear bomb. Mhm. Mm Lovely. Keep nice and uh. I'm a gloss sort of girl. Moisturised. Are you? Yeah. I can never wear gloss. Really? Why? I don't know. I feel like it's too sticky for me. I love it. Mm. Can't can't be without it. Okay. Well, here we go. We're done. So thank you so much for watching, guys. We hope that you really like our final look. Yeah. Let us, let us know who done their makeup better. <gasps> Ooh. No. Ooh. You can just rate our looks. Oh, okay. Out of 10. Let's not do that then. Yeah. Out of 10. Because Kyra's going to win. And I don't like ah! <laughs> <laughs> No. I think they're two different styles, so it's Very fine. Different, yeah. But yeah, let us know what you thought of this video. If you want to engage with any of the convo, Pop it in the chat below. Let us know if you've got any lies that you used to tell people about who your siblings are or anything like that. Um, but for now, we hope you enjoy the rest of the videos on this channel. There will be so much more to come. So make sure you like this one, mm -hmm. like it right now, and subscribe to the channel to keep up to date with all that is coming. And we will see you just anywhere on all of our socials. All of our socials. Yeah. Find us on Girl Got Faith. Yes, we'll see you soon. Bye.